cold southerly winds and snow on the forecast, it's time to get excited because temperatures are plummeting and there's precipitation to back that up, which should give all of the resorts snow base a good top up. So dress warmly, pack the layers and get up because it's about to get good. Welcome back to the Queenstown Wanaka Weekly Mountain Update. To the Remarkables, where they have the learners area, curvy basin chairlifts and sugar chairlifts now open, as well as everything at the base area. And the terrain park has been great for offering that opportunity to challenge yourself, learn new tricks or just get the old ones back. Reports are varying slightly from what we've seen, but it looks like further snow and cold temperatures are on the forecast, and the Remarkables could see 30 to 50 centimetres of new snow over the next seven days. To Coronet Peak, well they are watching this upcoming storm cycle with bated breath. Currently they have the family snowplay tobogganing and sightseeing all operational, and as the storm rolls through they'll be looking to reopen the M1 and the learners area. They're making snow whenever conditions allow, so this time next week we should be looking at a completely transformed mountain. Keep an eye on the Coronet Peak website for the latest in conditions. They'll be opening everything as soon as they possibly can, including night ski. To Cadrona, will they have McDougal's chairlift and the learners area open? And they also have a new rail park at the top of White Star with three rail features in it. This Saturday they have a DJ playing at the top of McDougal's chairlift. They've had some small top ups of snow overnight and they've got a lot more in the forecast over the next seven days. To other resort news, while Treble Cone has had snow in the Saddle Basin, as temperatures start to decline from Thursday onwards they'll be looking to open the mountain as soon as conditions allow. Keep an eye on their social media channels for exactly which facilities are going to be open. To the next seven days, well it's looking like freezing levels are dropping massively as we head towards the weekend. Some reports are even saying snow as low as lake level, looking like small top ups of snow from Thursday right through until Tuesday next week. Up to 50 centimetres of accumulation of snow is possible at higher elevation. So as soon as the sun pops back out, should be looking great in the Queenstown Lakes. That's us for this week's Queenstown Wanaka Weekly Snow Report. Until next Wednesday, I've been Nick Hine signing off from Kadrona for Mountain Watch.